Hello! In this video, we are going to prove the following theorem. Suppose a is a real number. If a is not equal to zero, then the reciprocal of a is not equal to zero. Now, we're going to be relying on three facts, which come from the field properties of the real numbers, in order to prove this. The first is that for every non-zero real number x, x times the reciprocal of x is equal to 1. The second is, for every real number x, x times 0 is equal to 0. Right, this fact can be deduced from the field properties of the real numbers. In fact, I made a recent video proving this. Right. And the third is that 1 is not equal to 0. Okay, so now let's get into proving the theorem. So, to start out our proof, let's give ourselves some real number a. And our goal is to prove if a is not equal to 0, then the reciprocal of a is not equal to 0. So let's assume that a is not equal to 0. And our goal is to deduce that the reciprocal of a is not equal to 0. Okay, so then let's assume for a contradiction that the reciprocal of a is equal to 0. Then we can establish a chain of equalities showing that 1 is equal to 0, which creates a contradiction because 1 is not equal to 0. And to see how we can form that chain of equalities, check this out. We know that from the first fact, since a is not equal to 0, it follows that a times 1 over a is equal to 1. But remember, 1 over a is equal to 0. But from our second fact, a times 0 is equal to 0. So we see that 1 equals 0, which contradicts the fact that 1 is not equal to 0. And our assumption that 1 over a is equal to 0 led us to this contradiction, so we must instead have that 1 over a is not equal to 0. And that's exactly what we wanted to prove, so this completes the proof. And so yeah, that's pretty much it for this video.